Hello, Jason here. And in today's video, I'm gonna be talking about septic tank grants. So why would you want a septic tank grant? Well, first of all, because the rules changed, right? All the rules and regulations uh, regarding septic tanks changed on the 1st of Jan, 2020, right? A year ago, just over, right? So basically the upshot is this. Every septic tank, every septic tank installed before 2015 now needs an MOT certificate. So if your MOT was installed before 2015, you won't have one of these MOT certificates. So for that reason, right, you're going to have to replace your septic tank and soak away, or maybe um, put it in a sewage treatment plant, something like that. But anyway, whatever the reason, it's gonna cost you about 10 to 15,000 pounds to do so. And most people like me just haven't got that cash lying around. You know, um, it's a lot of money, isn't it? And so for that reason, people inquire as to whether they can get a grant for their septic tanks. Well, forgive me a second, just get my board rubber. So that leads us on to the next question, right? Which is, can you get a grant for your septic tank? Well, unfortunately the answer is no. As of yet, you cannot get a grant for your septic tank, to replace your septic tank. You know, so there's no subsidies or anything like that at the moment, unfortunately, right? So you're probably thinking, well, great, he's, he's, this, is, this is bad news, isn't it? Why am I watching something that's so negative? Well, I've made this video because I wanna show you um, a, a very simple, and cheap and effective way in which you can get round ha having to spend out or fork out 10 to 15 thousand pounds. See the options that you'd normally ha have, as I've already discussed, right, is number one, get a company in, get a company in, right, to uh, 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 um, replace your old system. Now, as I said, and as I've already mentioned, as you know, this will cost you 10 to 15 grand, right? So that's option one. And many people are having to do that, okay? But the reason I've made this video is because I want to show you a better way. See, you can't make an omelet without breaking eggs. So it's going to cost you something, right? To replace your old septic tank and soak away. So for me, knowing what I know now, what I would do is if I had to replace my old septic tank and soak away, I would either, number one, put in a septic tank converter, uh, converter, why? Because these give you, they give you that MOT certificate that you need. And you'll save a minimum of 10,000 quid by putting one of these systems in. They're like a little black box. How much room have we got there? They're like a little black box like that that goes next to your existing septic tank and it gives you this MOT certificate. It saves you 10 grand and, um, and which is a lot of money, isn't it? So that's option number two. Option number three is if you don't want to get a septic tank converter because let's say you're building an extension and you've got to relocate a new septic tank and soak away somewhere, then in that case, I would go for something like a septic tank and soak away kit. Now a septic tank and soak away kit again <laughs> will save you about 10 to 11,000 pounds, right? These septic tank and soak away kits, I think they start at something like uh, 1499. 
and they come with a septic tank, they come with a soak away, they come with the um, inspection chamber, all the pipes, something like that. And they literally only take two or three hours to install. So although yes, it is a nightmare that septic tanks, in, if your septic tank was installed before 2015, you now need an MOT certificate and the only way to get one is to replace it. The good news is that, right, there is an alternative way. Get a government septic tank converter. I think this particular one is called um, an ecosystem, right? Or you can get yourself a septic tank and soak away kit. And you can get, you can put these, either of these are made for the DIY market. So you can put them in yourself or get your builder to do it, right? Take him a couple of hours. But the point is, look, it's going to save you 10, 11, 12,000 quid. So there you go. So I hope that's helped you and I hope that saves you money and I hope that solves a, a problem if you've got one. <laughs> but listen, thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video today. If you'd like to see more free videos, then just go to Septic Tank TV, type that into the internet. And if you subscribe to my septic tank tv channel you'll be in with a chance to win either an ecosystem septic tank converter or you'll be in with a chance to win a free septic tank and soak away kit so listen you stay safe you take care and i'll speak to you soon for more information just click the link below this video or visit septictank.co.uk for free help and advice